Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading. It's going to be focused on your love life. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notifications bell. And if you want a personal reading, you can get it at the TarotEmpress.com. Okay, so I'm seeing this energy that could be representing your energy at this point of time. And I feel like there's a desire to move forward in respect of your love life. So you're feeling a little bit like, uh, you know, you want to see some progress. You want to start moving forward in a relationship or anything that you're dealing with specifically during this period of time, right? So let's start clarifying this energy. Okay, so I'm picking up from the cards that there's a sense of heartbreak or pain regarding a certain situation that could be occurring in your life, and it could be difficult to overcome that. You might be feeling a sense of dread during this period of time, and you might not know where it's coming from, but you're experiencing it, okay? So there's a lot of emotions that are at play during this period of time. Your mind could be racing, you could be thinking about a lot of things, and you know, I get a sense from this particular card, you could pick in, you could be picking up the energy of the individual you're dealing with as well. They could be going through a hard time or having some sort of difficulties in terms of their energy and emotions. I feel like you feel blocked from loving this person and I feel like you have a lot of love to offer them. So clearly, you know, when it comes to your love life, you're feeling a little bit um, empty, a little bit sad because the person that you want to care for and want to be there for, you know, they might be off uh, doing their own thing or they could be preoccupied with their own emotions during this period of time, making it more complicated for you. I sense that you're trying to focus on your objectives during this uh, time, but I also sense from the cards that, uh, you know, you have this sort of desire to take the initiative, but at the same time, I also pick up from the cards that someone is being a bit closed off, a little bit defensive, a little bit guarded. This could be your energy, could be the energy of the individual you're dealing with. I feel like there's a wall built up and the two of you are standing, you know, on the other side of the wall. And um, I sense that the both of you can feel each other's energy, but I also feel like to climb that wall or to break it down is something very difficult right now which is, um, you know, quite, quite disappointing given what the two of you have been through. So I feel like in the past there was initiative to work things out, but I also feel like someone is pouring a lot of um, attention into something right now. It could be you or this individual. You could be focused on your career or this individual could be focused on something that's going on in their life that is going to require a lot of their attention, a lot of their concentration, a lot of their energy, okay? So what I'm sensing is that the combination of energies is making you feel agitated. And for some of you, you could be having sleepless nights or you could be looking for something to take away the sense of emptiness that you're feeling right now. 
So I do feel like for many of you, you're feeling stressed out when it comes to your love life because it's not going like the way that you want it to. And it's not really fulfilling you in the way that you thought it would. So I do feel like there's a lack of fulfillment in respect of uh, what you're experiencing during this period of time. Let's look at the next energy. And the next energy is showing to me that things are just not moving forward right now. Okay, so I'm picking up the card from the cards, right? There's this energy of either someone being stuck in a situation in which they feel unhappy. Could be you, could be the individual you're dealing with. There could be a lot of clashes. There might be a lack of emotional fulfillment due to this conflict, due to this tension. And the two of you, you know, may be going through something that's very difficult right now that is causing a lot of pain because I am picking up the energy of potential other people or it could be other elements or factors that are interfering. For some of you, right, I'm sensing that the person you're dealing with is trying to break free from something. They might have been stuck in a situation that was... Uh, basically eating their life. I feel like their freedom was very restricted or something was just just destroying them on the inside because I feel like they couldn't do what they wanted. They couldn't uh, go where they wanted. I feel like they just felt very, very restricted. Okay, some Something was just sucking the air out of them and it was literally like you know, just destroying them. I just feel like um, something was doing that to them. And um, it also feels like this person was drowning in their emotions, right? I feel like they were drowning in their emotions and they couldn't come up for air and they would prefer to just drown and die than deal with these things that were happening in their life. And I don't feel like you were the source of that. I don't feel like you were the reason why they were uh, going through those painful, painful feelings that were just... Uh, corroding who they are as an individual I feel like they were really suffering and uh, they're working on something right now I pick up the energy of them working on something and um, if they were in an unhappy relationship prior to you or if they're currently involved in an unhappy relationship you know I feel like this individual really was suffering a great deal really and what I'm sensing is your energy coming into the picture but I'm also picking up from this individual that they're feeling a lot of pain right now. They're feeling a lot of pain and sadness and emptiness and loss. And they're trying to wrap their mind around something that might have ended or something that may have occurred. But it's not between you and this individual concerned. And it's... I need to clarify this card. could be more difficult for you especially if you love this person a lot and you want to be there for them and they're not allowing you to you could get very frustrated because of that yeah i'm picking up a lot of pain from this individual a lot of grief a lot of worry something hurt them immensely they may have perceived you as, as well, you know, as um, either causing them pain or something causes them a lot of grief. Maybe you were talking to other individuals and they may have got freaked out or, um, you know, something may have hurt them a great deal. And um, yeah, they could have went through some period of extreme jealousy and that's why they're choosing to be quiet right now. 
and it could be really difficult for them. But I also feel like they're holding on to hope of happiness. This is a very complicated complicated situation i'm going to be exploring the balance of these cards on an extended reading you can find the links in the description box below if you want a person reading you can get it at the tarotempress.com have a wonderful day and take care